Hey folks! Welcome back for part 44 of Let's Play Discworld 2. If you recall, we were about to walk up here and scare Albert. I hope. Dude needs to be scared. Just like this. Albert! Albert! It is I, Death. Really, sir? Nice to have you back, sir. Uh -huh. Now we can get rid of that little prat in the pointy hat and dress. Hey. Well, at least I've proved I can use the voice. And that should be everything. I've ridden the horse, got the clothes, the voice, the scythe, the moves. Now, nah, nah, hold on. Being deaf isn't like delivering the papers. No, no, no. I can't let you go out hacking and slaying wholesale until you've had a trial run. Start small, mister. Collect hundred souls first, and then maybe you'll be ready to get out there and slay them. A hundred oh, come souls? come on. Right now? Yep. Couldn't we, you know, just come to an arrangement? Come on, ten gold pieces says we just, you know, forget all about it and get on with the story. Bribery, eh? Trying to buy your way out of a quest? Where would we be if everyone tried that? The eh? end of the game. Fine, right, well, let's go get 100 lovely souls for Albert and the principle of complicated gaming, eh? Bye-bye, mister. Don't trip and decapitate yourself on the way out. A uh, hundred souls. Ah, well, we haven't seen you in a while. From the Assassin's Guild. Mm. Do please come in and abase yourself at the edge of the yellow line. Now, come closer while I explain. Hmm. Not that close. Not that close. Oh, sorry. Now look, I want someone removed. A potential troublemaker. Somebody who's become too popular for his, or should I say, my good. And there has to be no way of connecting myself with his demise. Say no more, sir. Say no more. We shall strike like the subtle hand of doom, leaving nothing but weeping in our wake. For you see, we are the night. You are? I thought you were the Assassin's Guild. Ah, well, we are the Assassin's Guild, but we are also the night. So, in fact, you're that period of the diurnal rhythm defined by darkness, are you? So, nighttime thefts, muggings, murders, and overnight cart parking in restricted zones. We can just start billing the Assassin's Guild directly, can we? No more fussing about with tax collectors and fines. Uh, wh what? But that's because we are the night. Doesn't mean that we're that responsible for the night. Well, if you are it, then you have to control it. And if you control it, then you're responsible for it. This seems eminently sensible. I have a few thousand unpaid bills we can send your way by tomorrow. Uh, no, 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 no. N now look. All right. Um, we aren't ah the night, but we are of the night. Of. So we, we are an integral part of the night, without assuming any controlling or otherwise responsible position. So, whereas we can assume custodianship of unpaid bills, this will only be as a, a, a storage facility, a favor to you, my lord, until we find someone who 
totally encompasses all aspects of the night, whereupon we can pass the bills on to him. Oh, very well. So, in the meantime, just get on with this new job, huh? and don't mess it up like you did the Doom Guild last time. Kind of interesting that he hired... Well, I would be awfully tired of the Fool's Guild, too, if I had to put up with uh, the Jester and Chucky all day. So I'm not sure that killing and blowing up the guild was the right move. Okay, so we need souls. And we've explored everywhere. There's only one place where we found any souls whatsoever. We just have to figure out how to get them out. Little dots. Little dots, each with six little legs. Come on, they're almost in the next world. I'd need something better than my hands to entice them back. Now what do we have that can entice them? They're ants. I don't think it even has a soul. Good idea, but what should I do with it? Throw it at them? Oh, it's being difficult. Well, we have a fishing rod. Ooh, I hate to know what I'll catch. <laughs> and, yep. A pot full of ant souls. There must be at least 100 of the little blighters. And that's what we need, folks. I think before I actually hand it in, I will cut the video a little early. So I think the next bit takes a minute or two to get through. I don't really want to run over. But this will be the end of Act 3 very soon. Notice how short this was? Just a handful of videos. Act 4 is going to be pretty much the same. So, park out here, and I'm going to cut the video early, like I said, just to avoid running over. So, when we continue, excuse me, when we continue, we will give him his souls, and then assume the role of death. So until then, take care everybody. See you later.